Good morning, this is Dwayne, N6DMR from Bridgecom Systems Technical Support Group. First question today that I need to answer is, why is my APRS menu missing in my CPS programming software? Well, every time you get a new, as in updated, CPS or customer programming software, you need to go and initialize it properly. You go to the tool menu, you select the options submenu, and you'll go to the annex function setting. Now for a, for a 578 mobile or an 878 or an 868 with GPS, you click GPS. Any of those above radios with Bluetooth, you click Bluetooth. Since all of the radios uh, having a GPS have some APRS capability, uh, you, if you have a GPS, you should also click on the APRS setting. Now the, the fourth setting is called the 500 hour record setting. Uh, this is a special module. Uh, you have a choice of one module in the radio at any given time. So 99.9% .9 of the radios will have a Bluetooth module. At that point you do not have a 500 hour record module. If you turn this on, it will add a menu for the 500 hour record fu functions to your CPS, but that those menus do not interface with a standard recording option on the Anytone radios. Okay, that's check this okay. And there we go. We now have our APS menu, APRS menu. All right. And the second menu addition, because we checked Bluetooth, under the uh, Bluetooth tab or Bluetooth Vox tab, additional Bluetooth settings will appear. Okay, so that tells you, again, tool menu, options, setting my annex functions, which needs to be done every time you update your CPS to a new version. Once that new version has had the annex settings done, you do not have to do it again until the next CPS update. Thanks for your time.